Hey guys, welcome back. Today I am doing like an organizing my paper squishies video. I have paper squishies like floating all over my bedroom. So I just decided that I could have a nice little area to dedicate to all of my paper squishies since I've been making a ton lately. So let's get into the video so I can show you guys how I'm going to organize them. So I think the first thing I'm going to do is put them all on my bed and just so I can organize them and put them in the categories so I can say like food category or I'm not sure what else I have but I'll have to go through and see what I have because I don't even know what I have at the moment so let me put them all on the bed and I will come back. <laughs> So I have most of my squishies all laid out right here and I'm going to start organizing them because it's like all like miscellaneous like Among Us squishies and everything. So let's start organizing. I have a bin right here and I'm going to go grab I think one more bin so let me go grab them and see what I have. If I haven't already mentioned this, um, I'm also going to be organizing like all of my paper squishy supplies and making them look all aesthetic and all that. So, yeah. I'm cleaning this area over here because this is like the spot where I'm going to like store all my paper squishies. In the drawers, I just have like a lot of my adrenaline supplies, but I'm going to clear this off. I know there's some bins under there that can store some of my smaller squishies. So, and then snap my fingers. It is all going to be clean. I just got like this little thing clean. I'm gonna stick the like the squishies and the bins on top of it since I don't access these bins a ton. So now we're gonna step over here and start organizing the squishies. I have this bin and then I have this bin that I have just like random scraps of paper. So I'm just gonna like throw a lot of the stuff out in the bin out and then we'll start organizing. I just found a hidden paper squishy, so I'm just going to add that to the pile. I just got the bin, and now I'm going to start organizing. So in this smaller bin, I'm going to add anything that is not food related. And then in this bin, which are going to be like my food squishies, and since I have a ton more like food squishies, they are all going to go in this bigger bin. So the first round, I'm just going to go through and add all of my food squishies. And if I haven't mentioned this already, I'm going to keep out all of my Valentine's Day ones since that's the upcoming holiday. So if I see any Valentine's Day, they're going to be on display. This is one of my favorite paper squishies that I have. It's like one of my first like really slow rising paper squishies. Such good detail also. This one still has the tinfoil on it um, from when we did a video. I'm just going to take that off. Oh my goodness, this is one that I have that it ripped. So I have to take this one up. So I'm just going to stick this one in here for now and remember that I have to take that one up. This was one of my first squishies that I have ever made. I absolutely love this one. first 3D squishies. I love this one. 
my food bin is really filling up, so I'm going to actually, like, organize it and um, make it look really nice. So I'll be back when I'm done doing that. I am really loving the way it's turning out. Like, I really love the organized look, so I'm just grab one out that I want to play with. And, or if I want to do a video on it, so it's turning out really, really nicely so far. So, I am going to get the rest of the food squishies that I see, and I'm going to organize them. I am sticking, like, the ones in here that aren't, like, food-related, like the Squishmallow and the Bunny. So, I am doing that as I go along. <laughs> just finished putting them in the bin so as I told you this one's the food bin and this one is the bin that has like all the ones that aren't food related like Among Us the ones that I see and I decided that I wasn't gonna keep the Valentine's Day ones out just because I don't think I'm gonna have enough room for that but now we're gonna go stick them in their right place so I'm gonna stick this one in the far corner and this one, I'm going to stick right next to it. I really love the way this looks just because it keeps my squishies nice and organized and contained in a bin. So I'm so happy that I was able to do this today with you guys. And when I start growing my collection even more, um, I can get more bins and I can stick one on my nightstand or wherever else I want to stick them. But I really love the way this corner turned out. I hope you enjoyed today's video. Um, I hope that you had fun coming along and helping me organize my squishy. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked it, please give it a big thumbs up, subscribe, and share. And I'll see you guys. Bye!